What's good, y'all? Welcome to Lab and Legacy, formerly known as the I Am Site channel. We'll get into that at the end of the video. But today I was watching some really dope Kanye videos. He's one of the people I like to watch to get inspired. And not only does he work on his music, obviously he works on apparel. And I'm just in a mood to make a couple things today. So I've been online digging for gospel samples, just looking for something really soulful. I like the way this one is feeling. I'll let y'all check it out. Let's go ahead and build it out. Hmm, there we go. Oh yeah. I like that. We're gonna sample that. Ready to chop this, John. Started pulling up a beat. Just program this real quick. So what I decided to do is on the longer sequence, I made two, I made a short four bar version, I made an eight bar version. What I'm gonna do is uh, I'm gonna put this fill in on the eighth bar. It's the long version. fire I'm digging that so I think the beat is good I put this little section with a lead in maybe use that for like the second verse maybe like an extended chorus or something like that I know Kanye's been really controversial the last few years, but he's still one of the most inspiring, not only producers, but just creators for me. I'm one of those people that also likes to explore my other creative talents. I'm sure a lot of y'all are the same. I love making music, but I also like to make apparel, as you guys know. And watching these videos of Kanye is super inspirational because he's just kind of walking through his space. He's always building a really dope space. Like when he had the one in Wyoming, I was watching videos on that. That was super inspirational. Now he's got the one in LA. I watch videos about that. I watch those videos to kind of suit myself up, man. Sometimes you get caught up in one medium, you know, making music, making beats, and kind of getting a rut. And what I found is that by using other parts of my creative mind, working on apparel, working on artistic projects, working on other art forms, really just gets me inspired and it really fires me up to make music because sometimes you'll create something and you need a sound bed for it right or vice versa sometimes you make a sound bed then you want to make something visual for it we're going to get into that type of stuff a lot more on the channel different type of creators not just music but visual creators artists and things like that but we'll talk about that later let's get back into this beat i'll show you what i got so far
Well, that's what people need to realize about artists and people who dedicate their life to bring joy. They should be loved. I'm not a numbers guy. I'm a feeling, it's an it's a inspiration, it's channeling. You can't calculate love. How What's many? the feeling that you get? Uh, joy. So when you get joy, do you try to calculate? This is an infinite amount of words. So that was fun. That was really dope. And it's just like a little piece of what I like to do. Usually when I get inspired creating music, I want to go create something else. And sometimes it's the same day. Sometimes it's not. Sometimes it's a different week. But I use my music as inspiration to make other stuff and vice versa. So sometimes I'll just knock out something visual. And I know a lot of you are going to ask, you know, what's up with the channel name change? And really, I just had a bigger picture for what I wanted to do with the channel. The last five or six years have been great. I really learned a lot. You know, we really built a dope community with NPC Gang. It taught me a lot about the process of building a community and linking up with y'all on the production space has been a lot of fun. But there's so many other creative things that are interesting to me. I just want to expand the channel to talk about other things that inspire me the visual arts, things like cameras and lighting, different technologies that we can use as creatives to really just step our game up, step our businesses up. When I started thinking about the lab and legacy concept and what was drawing me to it, the lab is our creative getaway, right? And I'm blessed enough to have two. I have my, you know, music production and editing lab. And then I have my apparel lab, which, you know, as you can see, I'll make some music down here too. But it's just a beautiful thing to have a space to go create. And I want to bring more of that to the channel. The one downside to having a brand that's based on yourself is it really starts to feel self-centered after a while. You're just kind of talking about the things that you do. What I really want to bring to the channel is more content on what other creators do, people that inspire me, people that make me want to get in the lab and do my thing. And then when we talk about the legacy part, what are we leaving behind in the world? What are we leaving for our kids? For those of you who have kids, this is something that I think about all the time. And the cool thing about building a brand is you're kind of building an idea, right? An idea is bigger than just one person. The thing I learned about community is getting behind an idea. My vision for the lab and legacy brand is something bigger than just me it's a community it's an idea it's about staying inspired and I just have a much bigger picture of it in my mind that I hope I'm able to execute but it all depends on y'all support so I appreciate all the support thus far I hope I continue to inspire you with this video if you like the video make sure you drop a like let me know what you liked about this video what you didn't like I'm definitely interested in getting more feedback from you guys if you see anything in the video that you want to hear more about definitely let me know and if you see anything that interests you on the video It'll be at labandlegacy.com. I'm gonna put all the tools that I use as well as the apparel that I make, the different creations that I make on labandlegacy.com. And I hope you tune in for the next video. Hit that bell notification. Stay true, stay inspired, and keep that flame lit. I'll catch you on the next one, all right? Peace. Wow.